right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Sports Dom coming back with another video. The Arizona Diamondbacks complete the sweep. I think they said it was their first road sweep of the Cincinnati Reds since 2015. They get their first sweep of the season. They swept the Cincinnati Reds at Great American Ballpark. Now, this game was back and forth, back and forth. The Reds took a 1-0 lead. Then the D-backs took a 4-1 lead. Then the Reds tied it at 4. Okay. Then the D-backs took an 8-4 lead. The Reds tied it at 8. We go to 10. The D-backs take a 14-8 lead. Here come the Cincinnati Reds. 14-11 was the final. The Arizona Diamondbacks beat the Cincinnati Reds in 10 innings again. 14-11 this time. The Arizona Diamondbacks get the get the win. They get the uh, the sweep, but they lose a pitcher, Stephon Creighton, who got hit in the hand on a on a hit that went right back to him and hit him right in the hand. So now they definitely, I think, need to make a trade for a pitcher or sign a free agent. Something they need a relief pitcher. They need a pitcher. Uh, they can come in and get guys out, and they need somebody. Uh, there was 25 runs scored in this game. 25 runs. 14-11 uh, in 10. David Peralta, the freight train. Have a game, young man. 5 of 6. Seven runs batted in. Two home runs. A double and a triple, I do believe. Wow. 5 of 6. David Peralta, the freight train, got it going. And the Arizona Diamondbacks are red hot now. They are 5 and 2 on this 10 game road trip so far. Uh, they, they get their sweep. They split the series, the last series, uh, two games apiece with Washington. And now. They get on a plane and go to Atlanta uh, to play the Atlanta Braves for the Friday, Saturday, Sunday series. So that should be a good game. I know Luke Weaver goes tomorrow. I don't know uh, who goes for the Braves. Uh, but I think Ian Anderson uh, is going to pitch uh, in one of these games against the Diamondbacks, I think. I'm not sure, but I think. So the Diamondbacks got the sweep. They won four in a row. They improved to 9 and 10 on the season. They are one game below 500. Uh, and, you know, that they're, they're looking good right now. They won four in a row. Yesterday they won in 10. Today they win in 10. Wow, 14 11. That's, that's, a, that's a lot of runs, you know. But, like I said, the Cincinnati Reds just wouldn't go away. The D-backs took a 4-1 lead. Cincinnati said, uh-uh, not in our house. 4-4. Then the Diamondbacks took an 8-4 lead. You'd think that should be enough. Cincinnati said, uh-uh, not here at Great American Ballpark. 8-8. The D-backs took a 14-8 lead. And the Reds said, yeah, okay, it's done. In 10 innings. 14-11, ladies and gentlemen. The Arizona Diamondbacks. Congratulations, David Peralta. What a game. Um, and this team got the bats going. Josh, uh, Josh Rojas had a good game. Paven Smith. Uh, you know, uh, Wyatt Matheson, I think, had a hit. And uh, Caleb Smith gets the win, though, not uh, Taylor Widener. He allowed three home runs. Uh, he allowed four runs. Three of those were home runs. Um, and he ended up getting pulled. But Caleb Smith gets the win. And uh, with uh, Tyler Clippert injured, Stefan Creighton injured, Joaquim Soria injured, and uh, Chris Davinsky injured. Them are all pitchers. We need to make a trade for a pitcher. Maybe two pitchers. Uh, maybe go f through free agency and possibly a trade. Uh, but we need 
uh, some more pitching because we got four pitchers that are hurt right now. So guys, comment in the comment section below on what you think. And as always, if you like my videos, like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification so you don't miss a video. This is Sports Down. Peace. Go Diamondbacks. Uh, let's beat the Atlanta Braves in Atlanta. And uh, let's get it rolling again. Let's move up the standings now. Go Diamondbacks. Off to Atlanta.